some of you recall about a year ago I you know what let me just let me just go back just just flashback real quick this is this is what we have um there will be no more number one there will be no more sew-ins um definitely won't be doing this so it is January 27th 2022 so that was two years ago wow um <laughs> I thought it was a year ago it was two years ago I was traumatized for two years so here I am now with a sew-in <laughs> so just to give you a little backstory on my personal aesthetic and what I deal with with my natural hair my I have type 4 hair type 4c I like to say but let's just say type 4 and so my hair never looks prim and proper. Whenever you see, you know how you see pictures of hairstyles and their hair is so sleek and gelled down and the baby hairs. I let that dream go a long time ago. My hair does not do that. So my hair, I've embraced like the perfectly imperfect look. I don't like my braids to be perfectly neat or proper. I don't like my hair slicked down and smooth and sleek. My hair doesn't do that naturally, so I don't even achieve, like I don't even strive for that look. So if you know you're that girl with like the type three hair or you know the baby hair brigade, like this probably isn't for you because I'm not that girl. I don't have any advice for you on edge controls. I can't tell you anything about anti frizz. I can't tell you none of that because that's never been my life. So I just don't want you to be misconstrued about what this is. This is for the girlies whose hair is unruly, okay? So these are you nice kinky straight bundles. Kinky straight, meaning they have the texture in them and that is what I was looking for. Now when I was going on the hunt for which company to purchase from, a lot of companies have kinky straight hair, but the ends are not consistent throughout. Like I, I cut this a lot, but I'll show you clips of when I first opened the hair and the bundles were very consistent from the from the weft all the way down to the ends and that sold me immediately it sold me immediately because everybody else had like for example 26 inches but the ends were so sparse that it was a scam so here i am i have in three bundles of their of you nicest kinky straight hair that i have colored uh, as red as i can get it my roots are much redder than the rest of my hair but i don't mind because um, the ends of my hair are actually matches this so it, it ends up working out just fine. I have two bundles of 26 inches and one bundle of 24 and I've chopped it up and kind of layered it in my own way, my imperfect way. But this is what the hair looks like and I'll show you up close. I don't know if you can see like the texture in it. I'll show you at the root. you see the texture in it it's very like I would describe the texture as like crimps like small crimps um, that have been combed out with a small comb very frizzy I would say that this hair is perfect for when your hair is reverting if you're a girl like me who can't keep a silk press to save her life you get like two to three days out of it max um, that stage when your hair starts to revert this hair is perfect for that and I love it because it gives me Anyway, because I don't have to straighten it daily like you should have to do with some sew-ins so you know you have a leave out. I don't have to do that. My hair reverting is perfectly fine. And if you can tell, I left the hair big because that's how my natural hair will blend better. I don't try to straighten this bone straight. If I wanted bone straight, I would have bought bone straight bundles, you know? I need the texture in this hair because it works better with how much hair I left out. So for reference, I left out. my edges out um I've had this in for three weeks at, at the very least two weeks but going on three weeks and I have no complaints I wash it I'll show you clips of me washing it um I don't have any issues with tangling it 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 is so soft the hair is so soft even after dying it mind you I, I dyed this um, the hair is so soft, it does not lose its texture. I was so worried that if I dyed it, it would lose its like frizzy textured, um, you know, but it, it didn't, it didn't lose it at all. So this has been washed, 
this has been dyed, this has been um, straightened, it's been curled, and it's still very much, you know, textured, poofy, and I love it, and I love it. And my leave, if my leave out is not bone straight, because that's not what I wanted. I want to damage my hair further, but I did want to give the kinky bundles a try. So, I'm very happy with this. I feel like I got my money's worth. It came to about, I had a coupon, but it came to about $230 for three bundles. Three bundles was more than enough for a head full of hair. Like this hair is big. Three bundles was more than enough. And I still had a, a few tracks left, not to me, but that's also because I insisted on putting as much in as possible because I wanted the, the full look. I'm very happy with my purchase. I feel like I got my money's worth, especially because I don't have to constantly straighten my hair. I love that. I love that about this hair. I don't know why. When, when I think back to it, it makes more sense that I wouldn't purchase bone straight bundles, especially when I'm going to have a leave out because my hair doesn't even get bone straight when I'm trying to be as safe as possible pressing it out. It won't be bone straight. So I don't know why I spent so much time fighting with silky hair that doesn't match my hair texture. Uh, but anyway, you know, you live and you learn. So if you are a kinkier girl and you would like a sew-in weave, whether you straighten it or whether you just want your natural texture and just add to your afro, I highly recommend kinky style bundles. Highly recommend it. Shout out to you, Nice. Um, I am very satisfied. Um, I will be trying some more hair um, in the future just because of how happy I am with this. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. If you have any kinky hair companies that you would suggest. And I'll be checking that out. Make sure you follow me on Instagram.